the training sessions, we noticed visually that the Brits appeared to be flying higher than other teams. The first thing that we did when we came in off the water was pull the data from the Oracle Cloud to try and verify that observation. All the teams know that flying higher means that you have less drag, but it's also risky, and it's helpful to use the data to get an idea of where we are relative to the rest of the teams. From looking at the data, we were able to identify ride height as an area that we could push harder, and on the first race day, that's what we did. We feel like it worked well for us. If you look at the first race day, we had an awesome back and forth with GBR. It's the USA, Great Britain, here is the camera, and they're both pulling over 40 knots. The guys knew that they had to push the ride height, and you can see they're significantly higher on average. This is about the first 30 seconds of that downwind. USA was flying at 1.1 meters or higher above the water, doing 41.5 knots, whereas the Brits are flying much lower. They're about 0.9 meters, doing about 39 knots. So that seems really small, but actually that can make a significant difference in your downwind boat speed. 